Last weekend here on GDC, we told you about a suburban principal walking 24 hours straight to raise money for his students. It is his New Year's Day tradition, a New Year's Day walkathon. Richards High School principal Dr. Mike Jacobson completed his task and is joining us now. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Great. Thanks for being with us. How are you doing? Are you still recovering? Walking 24 hours straight, very difficult, I would presume. Yeah, it's it's harder than I anticipated it would be when I first did it. Uh, but this time, I think I did a little smarter, uh, took like a day off after and I'm feeling fine. And what I'm feeling best about is the group of people in the community came together, raised money for some great kids. So if all I have to do is walk for 24 hours and be in a little bit of pain, that is a very worthwhile sacrifice for the results we got. So let's talk about the pain. Last year, you were in a little bit more pain. Something about your toenails, right? <laughs> yeah, like I didn't uh, really think that much. I didn't do any research, looked into how I should prepare. So I didn't trim my toenails. And I didn't break in my shoes, which meant that my feet were really, really in pain. That after I lost oh. all of my toenails over the next like two months. So this time I listened to my wife a little bit. She's like breaking those shoes. We're going to make sure that you're not destroying your feet for the next week. And I listened to her and things are better. We had a, I actually had a, the last four hours are really tough. Yeah. But a lot of people came up to visit me. Students came up to walk with me. Parents came up to walk with me. So did the faculty. And it's just a great opportunity for us all to get together and send a message to the world at large that the kids need a little bit of help. And sometimes you got to suffer a little bit to help people. That's so great. Well, congratulations to you for setting this goal, for accomplishing it. This year, your goal was $30,000. How Correct. close How close to that did you get? We are we're like right at like 25. So... I'm excited that people are still interested because I'm hoping we can put ourselves to that 30,000 marker, which was a very, very ambitious goal, but we did real well in the, in the drama. People are still donating now, but I think the more important thing than the money, the money's temporary. I mean, if I give a thousand dollars to a kid, it doesn't pay for them to go to college. Right. The more important thing is I think it just sends, uh, it, it sets a precedent that we here at Richards are constantly looking for ways to help our students meet their goals and it's like i said during the walkathon when you hand a kid a check for 500 dollars, what you're really telling them is we believe in you what we're yeah. really telling them is your dreams are achievable and oftentimes even that small amount of money is the reason kids take a risk and go somewhere so more than the money what excites me is that a whole group of people came together parents students faculty and really said these kids are important let's put some time aside on new year's day and explain to them how important they are this is the second year you've done it correct Yes, yes ma'am. So clearly it works, principal. Why not? No, it know, does. Why not do this every semester, huh? Uh, because I couldn't. <laughs> I, there, I, 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 in fact, for the month after it, I convinced myself in my mind I won't ever do it again. That's the only way I could, I could move forward. And the days before it, I was in a deep depression knowing it was coming. I was like, I just want to start now. Because once you start, you're at least getting it over with. What's but, up? Uh, go, I go think I'll the, look for another thing to do. More go right through here. the mental uh, part of it, walking for 24 hours straight. And you got to, you got, you, you can't go fast, right? You got to set your pace pretty slow. Right. That's another thing. Last year I started really fast and I had, a, and I slowed down. You go slow, you talk to people, they keep you motivated and uplifted. The kids come, they do the same. I had a kid run up in the snowstorm and bring me a bottle of Powerade, which I thought was very nice. So, you know, you're not doing it like physically or even emotionally alone. But it does at about midnight, you've got eight hours left and every step you take is kind of like a, a knife in your hip. Ugh. You just gotta put your head down and keep walking. Yeah, say, okay, okay, how can we going. donate? Oh, well, there's a link on the website. Uh, you can click on that. It's on the Richards website, uh, Richards Walkathon. If you wanna Perfect. click on that, you can send a check to the school. But like I tell everybody, this is a good idea for every school. You don't have to give to us. If you are in the service area listening to the show, you don't live around Richards, your school's got a great fundraising opportunity. Call That's the high great. school down the street. Perfect. Every kid's in need. Well, congratulations, sir. Thank you so much. Go Bulldogs. Thank you.